What's up guys, Eternal here and today we're playing Diana after her rework in the jungle and I'll be playing against Kindred. Let's start with this and W first. I'll be playing with Dark Harvest, here are the rooms, this is going to be 40% CDR build and it will be focused on having low cooldowns, especially ultimate. So this should be fun. And right now Diana is much better jungler because she can impact much faster. With her E, you don't have to wait for your level 6 anymore. For the time of making this video, Diana has back on electrocute, not proking with her E properly, so it makes even more sense to go Dark Harvest and I'm sure that you like this keystone, so let's go with Dark Harvest, why not? W the shield for obvious reasons much better sustain jungle Okay Yeah, it's important to make use of your passive. First blood. So you gain 10% bonus attack speed, but mainly after casting a spell, your bonus is tripled for 3 seconds. So, in the game, it doesn't matter that much because you have to press both abilities at once, but later it makes a difference, like you press Q, then you press W after 2 seconds or 3 seconds and you will have your bones for a longer amount of time. So here's the icon showing you attack speed. And the dash. I can try on Olaf. Well, the burst got nerfed a bit. He's level 4. But he's out of mana. Okay, Ilari won't be able to join in time. He got hit. And that, wow, he had two kills already. So that's crucial. So now I press E to still keep my attack speed. If you press your E, while the target is affected by your Q, so marked by Moonlight, you will get a reset every time. Red Smite. And Boots, because I can't afford anything else. So that's it, you can gank easily, just press Q and E. Then, depending on your cooldowns, you can wait for another Q to obtain another reset. Let's gank. Okay. She has... No E. Well, Q works against Akali's Shroud, but here I just didn't want to miss, okay.
Okay, <laughs> bite it. I thought so, that's typical Akali. That was really risky, I knew that I don't have enough damage, but maybe if I just bait her, maybe Katarina can join. And that happened actually. So nice. But bot lane is feeling so much. I don't like this. Okay, let's back. And if you are wondering why Red Smite over Blue Smite with the passive granting so much attack speed, it makes much more sense to go like this. So while as Diana you can impact Ilya, you still need to farm, to scale, because her damage in the game is balanced. Well, it would be good to impact bot lane before it's too late. Your shield lasts for 5 seconds, your Q lasts for 3 seconds. Is that the Drake? Yeah, it is. Can I interrupt? Oh yeah, I can. Okay. Well, I don't have smite, so it's risky. Maybe we shouldn't. Who knows? Okay, waiting for my cooldowns. Guys, oh, yeah, that's not worth it. Wait, Katarina took the Drake. Hmm, <laughs> interesting. Oh, no, he was there all this time. Okay, I'm alive. I cannot turn back. Now ultimate. Well, Katarina is coming, okay. So there's an additional effect on your ultimate now. After pulling at least one enemy champion, after a while, you will damage. And the damage depends on the amount of enemies tracked. So this ultimate works like your old E. Hmm, not good. There's no lane that won't hurt. Not a single lane won. Okay, I like this. Okay, Katarina, you are fine. Need to help bot lane. Actually, this can be something, because if I hit my ultimate, it can really damage. Oh, oh, oh. 
Don't sell me. Oh yeah. Okay. What? Haha, <laughs> get wrecked. Nice teamwork. And this actually was effective. So yeah, slowly getting there with Diana. The sustain is pretty okay. So you need to play your early game right, as you can see. Okay, let's back for the full item. And now it's time for that cup. When you have the champion that scales so hard with ability power, then this is a great second item. Okay, Ilao, you got fat. Now, since the cooldown decreases, I'm going for E second. They have vision there or not? Ah, too far away. Okay. Ah. Uh. Yeah, now we can be creative with Diana. I like the additional effect. Actually, her passive scaling got nerfed, for example. But as for everything else, oof! I really had to be quick. Hmm, I can go this side and I survive, I think, yeah. So nice. I like Diana pre-rework and after rework she doesn't feel that different. Like, still the playstyle is the same with additional effect on ultimate and you just need to get used to the fact that you have your dash faster. I like the change. Okay, if Akali isn't joining. Okay. Fight her. Nice, okay. Oh no. I think he has ultimate. So I'm not coming closer. Where's Olaf? And not there. Hmm. Not enough for that cup yet. Akali has no ultimate. Oh, you can press Q and just activate your passive and take it faster. Okay, let's go. Hey, let's push. Q 
you for attack speed. Pay attention to this icon. W. Q. A. Really low cooldowns. Will get even lower. Okay. Oh, Olaf is getting away. Oh, oh, oh. Don't sell me. Ha! Pretty nice range. Okay, Kindred as well. I had ultimate ready for Akali's dash. Where is she? So yeah, that's really nice. And Dark Harvest, actually good. Actually better than Electrocute. A slow ultimate cooldown. Look at them. Yeah, let's do Drake. Vision, whatever. Let's push. Diana is good for speed pushing and this makes sense. It's hard to fight with her, especially at this point. My team is trying to fight. We are taking bot lane though. Look how fast she is, like, it's so good. Now they are coming for me, probably. So, two turrets, nice.
Ja. Wow. No, I'm dead, but it was really nice, I think. So now it makes sense to go Zonia. And finally, this. Now 40% CDR, let's see. Pretty low cooldown, and there's third rank to add. So we'll be even lower. Here are the rune stats that you asked for. Pretty fast clear. Wow, team fight started. And a really bad one. Let me zone here, come on. I'm alive. That's enough for Lich Bane. Oh, you are safe. You are there as well. Uh, I just go straight for base. Let's find out the ultimate cooldown. Thirty seconds. Inferno then. You can dash like this. My ultimate is at such low cooldown that it makes sense to use it like this at this point. Wow. Wow. What have I done? I forgot that this ultimate doesn't work like this. 
I actually thought that I tracked someone so I would damage after flashing, that's why. But thank you guys for watching, hope that you learned how to jungle with Diana and hope that you enjoyed. Leave a like, subscribe and see you next time.